it's Kim here and welcome to my home. You've joined me by my piano that I haven't played for a very long time and probably should start playing. Um, so yeah, I've got a bit of a, a different thing for you today. I've got a very special vlog, something I'm insanely excited about. Um, so it's coming up to Halloween, the witching hour is upon us, and uh, we are going to Comic Con. We didn't think it was going to happen because um, unfortunately uh, MCM pulled their budgeting last minute and were like, yeah, we can't afford you, bye. Um, but Twitch have come through and they're like, yes, we'll take you, you guys are cool. Um, so we're going to Comic Con, which is great um, because <laughs> I got uh, an amazing bit of cosplay, uh, I commissioned a bit of cosplay, um, which I was going to do, do at Comic Con, and then when we were like, oh yeah, we're not going to Comic Con, I was like, oh, crap. Um, but it's happening, so I get to I get to show you this thing that I've been working. Well, I've not been working on it. I've just paid for it, ha! Because <laughs> I am terrible at any kind of uh, creation uh, with materials and sewing and stuff like that. So I teamed up with the amazing Ninja Girl, um, who you may remember uh, I met last Comic Con, uh, and she cosplayed as Juto. Holy Mother of God, it was beautiful. And she's an insanely talented uh, cosplay artist. Um, I love you, Ninja Girl, I love you. She's also my unofficial waifu. Um, and so she has been very kind and done uh, a cosplay for me. And she sent it, if you see this giant box here that is perhaps bigger than me, to Kim. Uh, so it caused quite the stir in the office when this turned up because um, it is a massive box. Um, this has come from Europe as well, so uh, like it, it, it cost a lot of shipping, but it's fine. It's fine. So we're going to open it up together. So I know Ninja Girl is very worried that I'm accidentally going to throw out uh, bits of the costume with the packaging, uh, but I, I will make sure, Ninja Girl. Don't worry, I will make sure. So I could probably actually fit myself in here. Bubble wrap for days. I'm not going to need for bubble wrap. Ah, Ninja Girl has uh, sent me a letter, so I will make sure I read that properly later. Ooh, it's got, ooh, it's got secret notes on it, okay. I've got that. And I will make sure, Ninja Girl, that I don't throw anything out. Oh, it looks like she sent me half of Juto's, uh, Juto's outfit in here. Okay, you're probably gonna guess what this is straight away when, when you come and, uh, come and look at this, okay? Uh, so let, let's see how long it takes for you to guess this. I'm very excited about this. Uh, it's a character who perhaps I fell head over heels in love with this year. Uh, so I felt what better way to pay respect to this amazing person than by pretending to be her. I don't know. So come, come on, camera person, come on. You ready? You ready? You ready? Da 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 da. Oh my god. So we're gonna we're gonna take this out. Oh wow, this looks amazing! Um, so there we go, we're gonna try it on. Oh, this is so cool! If you haven't guessed what it was yet, oh my god, this must be, this must be the Jute, half of the Juto cosplay as well, because look, this material looks very familiar to me. Um, so these are, no, it's not, it's not a sexy mini skirt. It, it looks like it could be a sexy mini skirt, but um, these are the boot covers, I believe, so I need to get some actual proper boots. And then you see that zips around like that, uh, so it gets the cool boot covering like that. Ah! Here's a key thing. Here we go. So this is part of it, although this is not the full thing, but this is going to be part of it. So we've got that. Got my gloves. I think these are the wrist guards, I believe? Like that? Yeah, so the bottom bit of the gloves, so that goes with the gloves like that. Like that. There we go. Everything's really yellow now. It's, it's all gone a bit strange and a bit weird. And now, here we go. The most exciting part. I have wanted something like this since I was a child, okay? And I am insanely excited that this is now a thing that I can have in my life. And it is, come this way, a custom made proton pack. Look at that. And may I say, Ninja Girl, holy mother of God, you have excelled yourself. Get in there. Just don't look at me. Look at this. Look at this. It's a freaking Faraday cage. Um, so yeah, so I'll get the whole thing out. Oh my God, I am so excited. 
Uh, it looks like it's made it in one piece as well. Oh, I couldn't believe it. I think this was the thing that we were so worried about. Look at how amazing that looks. Ah! Oh, literally, ever since I was a small girl, I always wanted a proton pack, and now I have a proton pack. And I believe there's a few more surprises in there. So you're gonna put the camera down, I'm gonna get changed, and we're gonna see what it looks like, and I'm gonna, I, I, need, to, I need to concentrate to get this proton pack out, because I don't wanna, it's made it all the way here to England without being broken. I don't wanna like somehow just break it while we're on camera. So I'll be with you in a second, and we're gonna take a closer look at all of this. tiny child heart have come true with this. Look at this thing. Look at it. Look how sexy it is. Oh my god. I think Ninja Girl, you were so worried about whether or not it would make it here in one piece, whether or not we got the measurements right, whether or not you were good enough. And I think we just discovered you are the best. Like no one ever was. Look, I, I'm so chuffed with this. I think I'm pretty much going to be wearing this like 24-7. I mean, obviously, I'll get the boots on as well. Uh, I don't quite have the boots yet to go underneath the boot covers, so uh, I've not taped those on yet. But yes, uh, I've just got my Thor socks. Um, very handsome. With my Batman pyjamas, because why not? Um, but yeah, thank you so much, Ninja Girl. Uh, I'll probably work to get my hair done as well, so I can do the like curly front bit. Katie said that she's going to help me with that. but. I am the happiest I think I've ever been in like years. Like even happier than when I interviewed CM Punk. CM who? What? Jillian Holtzman is where it's at. I mean, look, I, I tell you what though, these pockets are so comfy. I'm just gonna be slouching all of Comic Con. I'm just gonna be like this. Yeah. Uh, apparently, this also mag magnets back this way, but I can't see a damn thing that I'm doing, so I'm not gonna risk it. But I can do this. Yeah, look at me. I am Kate McKinnock, even though I can't get her name right. So let's just keep calling her Jillian. Not now, phone! I'm being a Ghostbuster! Look, yes, I am Holtzman. I am one with the Holtzman. I mean, I interviewed Sigourney Weaver once. So that's basically like what? One degree of separation? Because she was in the movie and she trained Jillian Holtzman? But yeah, uh, so Comic Con, be there or be the square. Uh, I'm going to be there on the 29th and the 30th, which is a Saturday and Sunday. Oh, and uh, we have a special announcement to make that I'm going to make like this while I'm dancing because I'm so happy. Uh, we are going to stream a high roller stream from Comic Con on Sunday. Uh, so yeah, so hopefully we'll have the whole crew there. So high rollers, get your asses down on Sunday. Uh, I'm pretty sure that's confirmed. Uh, that's like 95% confirmed. Maybe wait until Mark tweets about it on the Yogscast thing, or just you know tweet Mark at uh, at Yogscast or at Sherlock Holmes, and uh, yeah, he'll confirm it. But I'm pretty sure we are going to be doing a high roller stream from Comic Con on Sunday with a live audience. So more details on that soon. But yeah, I think you know we're going to be going Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Sorry, I'm just killing imaginary ghosts. Voila. I'm talking to you. Um, but yeah, I think we're going to be there uh, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. I'm going to be there Saturday, Sunday. Now, the only problem is, is because we're on Twitch booth, uh, not our own Yogs booth, space is a little bit sh smaller, um, so it's not going to be a bigger booth as previous events. And uh, we are going to have to take it in terms to do stream slots um, here, there, and everywhere. So please, please, please be patient. We're going to try and see as many as you as we can. But unfortunately, we might not be able to in the kind of capacity that we've done at previous events, just because we're simply in a smaller area with a smaller booth. But I will do my best to see as many of you as possible, especially if you come and say, who are you gonna call? And I'm gonna be like, you're my friend, because Ghostbusters. So yeah, thank you again to the insanely talented Ninja Girl for, for like, making all my dreams come true. 
You, you make me a very happy waifu, and when we get married, I will be wearing this if you wear the Juto cosplay. Okay? Uh, but yeah, thank you very much for watching, guys. And uh, I guess I'll see you at Comic Con if I'm not out in the streets busting some ghosts. I can't stop moving. This is great. I'm so happy. Ah! Um, but yeah, love you guys. Ghostbusters! Oh, God, no. <laughs> Turns out I can fit in the box. So uh, I'm, I'm coming back to you, Ninja Girl. You're coming through the postal system. <laughs> I am a giant child, aren't I? Are you still filming?